Sure, Jim. Uh, thanks for having me back. It's uh, been a very quick year, and it's been a quick year because we've been able to accomplish a great many things in the past year, working with our colleagues at the federal level, but uh, principally working with our state and local partners, and, and primarily over the last year to support the maturation of the National Fusion Center network and provide them essential resources to empower them uh, to better operate the facilities that they own. Uh, mm -hmm. These are state-owned facilities and state-operated. Um, the collaboration that we've seen uh, has included the addition of territorial partners, for example, over the last year. Um, it's been uh, much more effective to the extent that uh, on a couple of occasions, information that has been derived from the state level has ended up uh, in the presidential daily brief and in one case uh, was used to uh, halt an illegal kidnapping. Um, but one of the things that I think we've from principally focused on over the last year is not just sharing information, but sharing information responsibly. And uh, that means taking the commitment, making the commitment to respect and protect the privacy and civil rights and civil liberties of all <coughs> Americans. Uh, we've partnered with the Privacy Office and DHS and Civil Rights and Civil Liberties Office. We've done this jointly with the FBI and with our state and local partners and with our general counsels to make sure that we're doing this in a way that's consistent with the expectations of the American people. We've also uh, been very committed to uh, providing the people, the tools, the training, the technology necessary to enable this network to be more effective. To that extent, um, we are now over $320 million that we've spent in support of this national effort. Uh, DHS has deployed over 34 intelligence officers and uh, We've done jointly with our federal partners over 145 technical assistance visits to these centers over the last year, so you can, or over the last couple of years. So you can see it's an ongoing effort. It takes a lot of work and coordination, and uh, we'll get into more of the challenges later, but uh, it's been a fun year and an effective year for DHS.